This is Finbar, Steamy, Ellie, and I'm Shanna. Uh, yeah, we formed in 2019, just, just Finbar and I, and then COVID, bam, so no band. And then we found Ellie, we found Steamy, and we are now a band. Uh, the meaning behind Trump, um, I mean, well, four of us are big tramps, but the whole the whole thing is like being provocative in that, like you know, making people uncomfortable because it really has. Like we were in another band with a similar kind of like slur, but not you know, they're just like kind of a misogynistic <laughs> name that's used against women, um, and people did not like it. But that's the whole point, like um, taking it and just being like, yeah, that's what we fucking are because you're gonna get called it anyway. You can do no right. You're a virgin. You're a whore. You're a slag. You're a fucking. Trump. Trump. <laughs> you're a fucking frigid, like, you know, and fuck it, you can't, you can't win in this life, so it's nice to just to be like, yeah, I'm a big fucking Trump. Uh, we recently released our first, our debut single, Frankenstein. It is the first song that we have on all of the platforms, like all of them. I'm not going to plug them, but you can go find it. Frankenstein Trap. <laughs> <laughs> um, and we made like a really fun music video for it as well uh, with Jerry Craig and that with a bunch of mannequins. And it's definitely a bit ridiculous, but it's, yeah, it's, it's what it is. Um, but we had the single launch for it because we were like, right, start off with a bang. Trump, 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 Trump. We've, this is just the beginning. <laughs> Launch was great, yeah, we had a great response. And uh, yeah, it was great. The support acts were amazing. And packed, it was amazing. Yeah. Uh, sold out. Sold out. <laughs> yeah. Because we were like, I'm going to sell out. Oh my God. And then it sold out. We were like, and then people were like looking for tickets. And we were like, I know. You want to see us? We're like, ah, uh, I don't know how many tickets are going to sell. We're all freaking out. And sweet. Did you just look at you? <laughs> yeah, the recording with Liam Craig was amazing as well. And it's like, oh, that felt so good. We we're like, oh, this is this is what we want to do. This is what we want to do, and we did it. We did some more. We've got some more on the way, so it's good. Life is good. <laughs> <laughs> Itself, Fembar and I wrote, uh, well, Fembar wrote the like sweet little riff, and then um, I had like all this stuff about like conditioning, you know, like trying to unlearn a bunch of stuff. And um, don't exactly know where the Frankenstein thing came out of, but it was just like very apparent that like we're all just made up of a bunch of people's <laughs> shitty opinions and they're not actually ours, and like we purely lose ourselves. And yeah, but a bunch of the songs, like. They kind of seem really sweet, I think, but they're 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 kind of about a lot of shit. <laughs> um, and like giving out about everything, just <laughs> everyone and giving out. Just, yeah. But there there's a lot of material that like we have when we want to use that we want to release that the radio would not like, <laughs> particularly about the country that we live in and the shitty church influence <laughs> that is still very rife today and all the injustice and there's a lot of stuff that like we are dying to let out but um uh, to start off we need to play with we need to fucking play the game like we need to get on the radio first get our fucking get our get our name in get people's mouths first um, censored <laughs> censored a little we, bit yeah really. just which is really shit but um you know what at the end of the day like we're gonna be hurt so 